Hello, I'm Yvonne and I'm a consultant here in the emergency department. Now we all know that people come to the emergency department by ambulance when they've had a serious injury or accident. But do you know when you should come? Let's take a look. The emergency department is a really important place. We can give the best quality care to the most unwell patients when people only use the emergency department if they really need it. Knowing where to turn to when you are ill or injured can help save lives. If you need urgent medical attention or have a life-threatening situation like a broken bone or suspect you may be having a stroke or a heart attack or suddenly feel unwell and develop severe abdominal or chest pain, you need to come straight to the emergency department to see me and my team. If you have a very sick child, a breathing problem or severe bleeding of any kind, you need to come straight to the emergency department. Remember, the emergency department is for broken bones or life-threatening situations only. We're not here for second opinions or to carry out non-emergency medical investigations. If you come to the emergency department and we feel it's inappropriate, we may ask you to see your GP, call NHS 24 or visit your local pharmacy. If you feel unwell and it's not an emergency, there are plenty of places you can go. Going directly to the correct healthcare professional with the appropriate skills is very important. It helps you to a speedy recovery and makes sure NHS services are used properly. Visit your GP if you have an illness or injury that just won't go away, like vomiting, chronic back pain, headache, flu or ear pain. Your GP knows your medical history and can give the best possible advice. Your GP can help manage chronic conditions such as high blood pressure, diabetes and asthma. Your GP can refer you to specialist healthcare professionals and organise the most appropriate investigations. When your GP surgery is closed and you're too ill to wait, you can access medical advice through NHS 24. 111 is the free telephone service for NHS 24. They can signpost you to the most appropriate care for your illness or injury. Call 111 if you're unsure where you need to go. Through 111, NHS 24 can arrange for you to see a GP or nurse out of hours. Call 111 if you need emergency dental advice and your dental surgery is closed or you're not registered with an NHS dentist. NHS 24 can assess your symptoms and provide care and advice during the evening, night and at weekends. NHS 24 provides information and advice when you're ill and it can't wait until your regular NHS service provider reopens. NHS 24 can also provide advice if you're concerned about your own or someone else's mental health when other services aren't available. For a speedy recovery, self-care is often the best option for a minor injury or illness. Visit your local pharmacy for expert advice, information and help with your medicines. They can help with coughs and colds, minor wounds, minor burns, constipation or diarrhoea and aches and pains. They give confidential, expert advice on a wide range of common illnesses and ailments. So let's be clear, the emergency department is for broken bones or life-threatening situations only. Your GP for illness or injury that just won't go away. Call 111, the free telephone service for NHS 24, to access information and services out of hours or if you're unsure where you need to go. Your local pharmacy provides expert advice and treatment on a wide range of common illnesses and ailments. Next time you're thinking of visiting the emergency department, stop, think, is it an emergency? If yes, come straight to the emergency department. Thank you to the people who only use the emergency department when they really need it. This allows me and my team to provide the best quality care to the most unwell patients. It's your emergency department. Please use it properly.